Hey there, welcome back to Pokemon Sacred Gold. Um, just beat Lance, and now we're going to Kanto. Um, I added uh, Flourish to the team. I don't know if I did that last time. I hate this thing's name. <laughs> but it's a Monist Ponyta, which, um, you know, is, isn't great, but I guess it works. Um, it's not that bad. I mean, it's pretty bad, but it, it could be worse, is what I'm trying to say. Um, it's just going to hold the XP share. I didn't feel like training it up. I, I'm just going to Kanto. There's no gym leaders coming up right now, anyways. Actually... Maybe there is. <laughs> Maybe there is. If there is, I mean, I don't know if I fight the first gym leader as soon as I get to Kanto or not, but either way, I'm I'm just going to Kanto. I'll fix my team if I need to. For now, I didn't feel like training it up. Thank you, Oak. Ugh. Okay, so, yeah, I'll, the first thing we have to do before we get to Kanto is go on to the SS Aqua. Which is basically the SS hand, but not. There's a bunch of trainers on the ship that we can fight. Um, you know, the, the usual. So I do think it's quite a little bit of time before we actually do anything in Kanto. Uh, hello. Let's see. So I'm gonna be able to get a lot of new encounters once I get there because obviously it's a whole new region. So I'm gonna get plenty of new Pokemon. My bo my box was looking pretty sparse recently, um, filled with nothing but water and or ground types. So I haven't had many good Pokemon to use. So hopefully once I get to Kanto, I can get tons of new stuff. Not how much I like the music on this boat. Okay. So this is our cabin. We can come back here to use the PC and heal. And then every other room should have like a trainer, yeah. That's fine, I'll, I'll try to fight everyone, it'll give me the training I need. Okay, 55. I wanted to see what the level curve was like. Um, I, I was worried that there might be a huge spike in difficulty once we got to Kanto. Which might still happen, because I'm pretty sure... You know, everything's gonna be way harder than it usually is, obviously. And that includes red, so I'm a little bit scared for red, even though I have quite a while to go until I fight him, but I'm still worried. I didn't die of that. He did get paralyzed. Because I might have to do a lot of training to fight red, and if I lose, I'll have to do all that training again, so I gotta be careful. But it's, it's a long time from now, so I shouldn't start preparing now anyways, because, you know, to be honest, by then all my Pokemon are probably going to be dead. If I even make it to red before I run out of Pokemon. We don't really need to take them. Yeah, I was worried they wouldn't be trainers. Okay, let's go ahead and uh, switch because Eddie's gonna get murdered if I'm not careful. Let me switch out both of them then. Actually, no, I, I can stay in with Raichu. If I Thunderbolt, the Driftblim actually. Driftblim might not die. <laughs> So instead, let me switch just to be careful. Um, go into Arnold, and then I'll swap Eddie into Lance to tank the grass type move. Okay, I think it went for Solar Beam, I wasn't actually paying attention. Uh, let's see, um... Solar Beam won't do any damage to Lance. So let's just go ahead and use Strength on the Drift Bloom, and then I'll have this Wing Attack Tropius. Actually, let's double into the Drift Bloom, just cause I... Ah, no, let's take, let's take care of Tropius. It's not gonna die of just Wing Attack, I think. But, you know. Battle on Solar Beam. Oh, wow, wait, he Solar Beamed Raichu? Why didn't he Solar Beam... Why didn't he attack my Quagsire with that? 
Okay, and that just dies to strength. I forgot it still had the life orb. Good thing it's still alive. Let's swap out. I mean, I know I'm going to kill it with wing attack, but just in case wing attack misses somehow, and then I hit it, Arnold would die. Which I don't want to happen. Actually, switching into Eddie wasn't really a good choice either, but it's fine. <laughs> I don't think this uh, this boat has too many trainers. It's not quite as big as the SS Han, if I'm remembering correctly. I think it's only like these eight rooms and then maybe like a couple more. Uh, I don't think I'm gonna be able to kill this. I don't really want Raich to take a blizzard. Let me just swap just because. Um, actually, no, I'll stay in. Let's fly. My whole team isn't doesn't really want to fight Obama Snow. <laughs> uh okay, we're fine. And he died to Woodhammer. Great. Oh, there's the one shot. I didn't think that one shot. I mean, it crit obviously. But Oh wait, no, I'm thinking of Sturdy. Sturdy doesn't work in this gen. I always forget about it. I have to force myself to remember that Sturdy was basically added in Gen 5. I know it's in this game, but it's garbage in this game, so it doesn't count. <laughs> it's like having Runaway as your ability, but worse. Why can none of these doors are locked? I mean, that's how it is in every Pokemon game. No one ever locks their doors. Wait, what? There'd be no Fiona. If you can show me Fiona, I'll give you a reward. Well, if I ever find one, I'll be sure to bring it to you. I think you can actually find them wild in this game, but I haven't seen one. And the, if, there, if you can find them, they're a super, super low chance, so there's no way I'm going to be able to get one. Ariana. Uh, I'm a little worried about this, because I'm not going to one-shot it, so instead let me just swap. Uh, yeah. Randy should be fine against this. Yeah, he can't touch me. That's good to know. Stop using a door. Thank you. <laughs> Goodbye. Oh, I still can't go that way. Oh, I have to find the guy who's sleeping. Right. Okay, I'll come back. Um, little girl. I think the little girl's behind that guy, so I have to go back up to the stairs. This guy's throwing up. Oh, he still battles me, though. copied static. Oh no! You know, if I actually had lightning rod, that might have been a problem. Ow, ring out. Whoa! Okay, chill out. I probably should have gone for a physical move. It might have done a little bit more. I'm not sure what... I'm pretty sure Jinx has fairly high special defense compared to its defense. Scyther could have quick attack. That's why I'm swapping. Otherwise, I'd just bop it and that'd be it. Don't flinch me. Okay, I was worried I was gonna get flinch cheesed. Okay, I'm just gonna go back up and heal, and then I'll go find that guy who's sleeping. He's in the room next to me, right? Oh yeah, he is. I like how I can see through the walls. Again, worried about these fighting types. Uh, if I use fly on this and it doesn't die, then Ryan's gonna get his teeth kicked in. 
dynamic punch, yeah. Actually, I think if I went for fly, he would've hit me with that. Um, no guard hits you through fly, I'm pretty sure, still. Um, does it do that? I, I can swear that it does. So if I used fly, he would've hit me midair with dynamic punch and I'd be dead. I need a stone edge. Uh, please, no! <sighs> yeah, that's how it goes. Moves with high crit chance, always crit. So many crits going on right now. <laughs> that's terrible. I mean, Gengar was adamant, but it was also still a Gengar, so that's that's not epic that it died just then. Oh, uh, that's really bad. Let's see. Kingdra. Uh, probably not a good idea for me to stay in, but it's okay. Oh, he dragon danced on me. I think I'm still faster. <laughs> That sucks. Okay, I'm not gonna add anyone to the team right now. I'm gonna stick with this. That's so annoying that he crit me with Stone Edge. <laughs> if I wasn't adamant, it actually only survived because I was adamant. Like, even if, if I was any other nature, the, uh, the special attack drop wouldn't have mattered. It was that close to death where, like, if I had, like, three more points in the special attack, it would have died. That's annoying. But I guess that's the price you pay for using adamant Gengar. Excuse me. This is the little girl, right? That I'm looking for? No, it's not. It's just a random trainer. <laughs> yeah, okay. It's just a random trainer. Oh, I remember. The little girl's bothering the captain, right? I think so. Yeah. Odd's calling me. Howdy. Uh, he must be a lot better. Okay. He actually wants to battle. Wow, that's new. Usually they call me for no reason. I'm not gonna go battle him, but it's a nice change of pace. Alright, we have to go play hide and seek with her. Great. Well, I already beat all the trainers on the ship, so it's not gonna be that hard to find her. She's only in like two spaces, I think. Um, if I can remember where they are. Yeah, here's one. Oh, that's it. I don't like to find her once. Okay. Alright, well, that's the SS Aqua completely done, and here we are in Vermilion City. Oh, wait. <laughs> this isn't the exit. This is the exit. Okay, we're officially in Kanto. I mean, we were officially in Kanto when we were on Route 26, but now we're officially, officially, hey, now we're officially, officially in Kanto. And we can get our first encounter here in Vermilion City um, with Surf or Fish. Oh, hey, it's Suicune. I'm not battling Suicune now, am I? Okay, good. It's just we're gonna run off. Alright, so should I surf or should I fish? I think I'm just gonna surf because I don't like fishing. <laughs> Luck incense, that's not needed. I have an amulet coin. Ooh, Kanto battle music! And a wingo, that's dupes. Let's see, please give me something new. Probably just wingo and tentacle here. I might have to fish. Or just settle for dupes, but I don't really want another wingo. Is there anything else I can get here? Okay, let me just try uh, fishing. That's not how you fish, I can click the bottom screen. My turn. Um, hmm. 
It is tempting to just catch this. Let me just see what else there is. I might call that as my dupes encounter if I can't find anything else. Because there might be a, like other stuff like Starmie here. Which would be dupes too, but I technically don't have a Starmie since my Starmie died. But I don't want to get another land turn if I don't have to. I'd rather get something that I don't have, like this. I don't have a shelter. That's my encounter. Why don't I have any quick balls? Why do I never have quick balls? Don't die to surf. <laughs> Are you serious? <laughs> Alright, well. All right, that's how it goes. Whatever. It was another water type. I don't need it. I don't need it. Alright, any of you people in Vermilion City have something to give me? I can't go into the gym yet, right? I'm so glad there's no cut tree there. I'm pretty sure, actually, there usually is, but... Um... Wait a minute. Uh, well, Drown will move the, remove the tree is what I was going to say, but... Um... Normally, this isn't what happens. Um, normally you're supposed to fight Lieutenant Surge as the first gym leader here, but I think Drayano changed it so that you're supposed to fight them in the normal order, um, so he could better balance them, which is actually really cool. I like that. Um, that'll mean that, like, because usually the level balancing in Kanto is terrible, because you can do the gyms in any order you want. Um, <laughs> so, like, they're usually about the same level, so once you beat one, you're basically high enough level to beat all the others. Yes, I told you about your rapid ash. Thank you. Give me what are you gonna give me? A rare candy. No bike voucher this time. If he gave me a bike voucher and I could just sell the bike for a million dollars, that'd be great. Isn't this the house where you normally get chiding? No. Okay. But um, yeah. So it, it Kanto gyms should be a little more well balanced than they usually are. At least in this game. Which is a nice thing. Quick balls. Thank you. Like 30 of these. I shouldn't have spent all my money on it, but it's okay. <laughs> I wanted them, so. I'm gonna be catching a lot of new Pokemon, so quick balls are very appreciated. This guy gives us the Super Rod, I think. No, Elder. You're gonna put like a Rage. Oh no. Okay, now he's he's just here. Is there anything in the Pokemon Center that I'm missing? Now Gengar is still dead, but he's in my party because I didn't feel like getting a new Pokemon. I want to catch a, st a couple of things in Kanto first before I add anything to the team. But let me put Gengar into the dead box. Yeah, there's nothing else here that I want to add that would replace it. I guess the only thing, no, like, everything I add would be a duplicate type of some kind, except Shedinja. No, even Shedinja, I have a bug type. I have, I have such low type diversity in my box. I guess I could probably add Tauros if I wanted, which I might do. If, I, if anything, I'll add Tauros. But I want to see what I can get in Kanto first. It's like, my, my box is looking really bad right now. I, I'm hating it. Hello. Oh, okay, great. Oh no, I'm not taking a picture with you, Cameron. I should have used Rock Smash. I, I didn't know there were rocks here. If I could Rock Smash, that would have been way better. Are you also? No, I thought he was also Cameron the photographer, just like duplicated. Okay, we can't go into Route 11 because Snorlax is here. But I can go into Diglett Cave to head to Pewter, which is where I'm supposed to go, actually. So let me do that after, because I want to see what I could get on Route 6? Is that Route 6? Route 6 is above Vermilion, right? Yes, okay. I want to get my Grass Encounter here first. The TM for Silverwind. Cherum. Well, I don't have a Grass type right now. I don't have any Grass types, do I? Oh, I have, uh... What's it called? Other thing. Lilip. I have Lilip in the box still. But I actually really like Channel this Pokemon. Um, I, it's just so bad usually, but hopefully... Come on. 
being as difficult as possible. Ryan, you need to calm down and stop trying to murder everything you see. I really need to stop thunderbolting things to weaken them, because <laughs> it's just not safe. Thank you. Okay, cool. Um, I actually really like Cherub. It's a pretty cool Pokemon. It has a really cool ability. It's just not a good Pokemon, which always disappoints me, because I love it. There's a lot of grass types that I like that are just too bad to be used. <laughs> what do I name this? Um, Sandra. Hopefully I haven't named anything else Sandra. Bold, which is actually useful. Flower Gift, It's that's a normal ability. I might give it Solar or Sunny Day just because. Um, I'm not, it's not on the team right now, so it, it's not going to be added to the layout. I still have a few more Pokemon to add. But it is a good contender because it doesn't have any duplicate types. I can't go down here yet. And I can't go to Saffron City. Okay. So, yeah, the only place for me to go is to Route... Or not to Route 11. To uh, Diglett Cave. Where I'm going to get a Diglett, I guess. Uh, let's sleep with these two. Force is coming in level, you know, on his own. It'll take a sec before it evolves, but I'm just going to leave it with the XP share. And probably a slacking too. Ooh, hoo -hoo. cool counter. That's my favorite thing to get hit by. Great. <laughs> oh, great. Well, he's he's uh he's in truant turn this turn, so I can just earthquake. Oh, great. He's gonna he's probably gonna hit me with something, but nothing he does is gonna kill me. He has flail. That's not going to kill Eddie, right? Please! Okay. Just really hoping that number would stop taking down. Oh my god. Okay, well I guess I don't have my Rock or Bug type anymore. So, you know, I said I wasn't going to do any training, but now I think I might need to. I have three Pokemon to add to the team. I say three, because Floris is not a very good Pokemon. So, <laughs> that's cool. I didn't expect Armaldo to get murdered by this slacking with counter randomly. Oh, you have so many Pokemon that are gonna die. I'm, I'm not even close to losing <laughs> all the Pokemon I'm gonna lose in this game. Oh boy, we haven't even finished the first gym in Kanto. I already lost Gengar and Armaldo just on the trip here. Let me get my encounter in Diglett Cave, then I'm gonna end this episode and maybe do some training. They're not Cameron, right? Diglett is dupes. Um, come on, don't make me trap me, thank you. I don't have any flying. Oh, I do have a flying type. Um, I'm gonna look around a little bit because there might not just be Diglett here. Um, I can basically just grab Doug Trio as my encounter instead of Diglett if I want, uh, since it's already dupes. But I, I want to see if there's anything else here because there might be other Pokemon added by a Dreano. I mean. Just as a rare encounter. Alright, whatever, I'll just catch this Doug Trio. Actually, this might kill it. <laughs> oh, it lived! Oh, it lived! Oh, that's great. A small time. Thank you for surviving. I really shouldn't have fire punched it. But it's okay. Actually, I still have a dig in the box. It's not even dead. I don't think this fits, does it? No, it doesn't fit. Oh, well, I can... I can do it this way without a comma. <laughs> Ed, Ed, Eddie. There we go. I shouldn't have even put the comma in the first one, because now it ruins the whole thing. But it's okay. Alright, let me just go check out Ed, Ed, and Eddie. 
and then I'll end this episode while I do a little bit more training and try to get my team fixed up. Impish, which is good. It's sand veil. Actually, the only reason it survived the fire punch is because it's impish. That's crazy. Uh, sand veil, which is whatever. My body. Yeah, it's, a, it's a drug trio. I have no complaints about it. What's this? It's nature. Quiet. Yeah, that's a lot worse. Um, and I don't really need arena trap anyways, so I think sand is slightly better. Alright, um... Yeah. I guess that's the end of this episode. I'll try to fix up my team a little bit, and then... We'll head to Pewter City. I don't think there's that much to do in Pewter City. Um, I can get a bunch of encounters on like Route 1 and uh, Pallet Town, I think, if it lets me go there. Uh, so, yeah, I have a few more encounters to get, and then uh, I'll fight Brock without hopefully getting murdered. See you next time.